Hello everyone, welcome to Root to Mathematics. In this video, we are going to solve these equations. So the given equation is x by y plus y by x equals to 17 by 4. And the second equation is x square minus 4xy plus y square equals to 1. Then what will be x and y? So here we are given two equations and we are asked to find the variable x and y. So without any delay, let's start the solution. So we have given x by y plus y by x equals to 17 by 4 let's take it as equation 1 and x square minus 4xy plus y square equals to 1 let's take it as second equation now from equation 1 we have x by y plus y by x equals to 17 by 4 so in the next step let's just multiply x in both numerator and denominator of this term so we have x multiplied by x divided by y multiplied by x plus now here we will multiply y in both numerator and denominator so we have y multiplied by y divided by y multiplied with x equals to 17 by 4 so this implies this x multiplied with x we have x square by xy plus y square divided by xy equals to 17 by 4. Now taking LCM we have x square plus y square equals to 17 by 4 xy. Let's take it as equation 3. Now from equation 2 we have x square minus 4xy plus y square equals to 1. So this implies this we can write x square plus y square minus 4xy equals to 1. So from equation 3 we have x square plus y square equals to 17xy divided by 4. Let's just put the value here. So we have 17xy divided by 4 minus 4xy equals to 1 so this implies this now taking lcm we have 4 here we have 17 xy minus 16 xy equals to 1 this implies this xy equals to 4 and this implies this y equals to 4 by x let's take it as equation 4 now in the next step let's just substitute this value of y in equation 2 so from equation 2 we have x square plus y square minus 4xy equals to 1. So this implies this. So x square plus. So from equation 4 we have y equals to 4 by x whole square minus 4 multiplied with x multiplied with 4 by x equals to 1. So your xx get cancelled out. So this implies this x square plus 16x square minus 16 equals to 1. This implies this. Now taking LCM we have x to the power 4 plus 16 minus 16x square divided by x square equals to 1. Now by cross multiplication we have x to the power 4 plus 16 minus 16x square equals to x square so this implies this we have x to the power of 4 if i take this x square to the left hand side this will become minus x square so we have minus 17 x square plus 16 equals to 0 now in the next step we can write x to the power of 4 minus the 17 x square as 16 x square minus x square plus 16 equals to 0 this implies this now taking x square common from these two terms. So we have x square multiplied with x square minus 16 and minus 1 common from these two terms. So we have x square minus 16 equals to 0. So this implies this we can write x square minus 16 multiplied with x square minus 1 equals to 0. So here we will apply an algebraic identity that is a square minus b square equals to a minus b multiplied with a 
plus b. So applying this identity, we can write this x square minus 16 as x minus 4 multiplied with x plus 4 and x square minus 1 as x minus 1 multiplied with x plus 1 equals to 0. So from here we can write x equals to 4 or minus 4 or 1 or minus 1 where the possible values of x. So now let's just find the value of y for each values of x. So for x equals to 4, y equals to we know that 4 by x which is equals to 4 by 4 equals to 1. So for x equals to 4 we have y equals to 1. For x equals to minus 4 we have y equals to minus 1. Similarly for x equals to 1, y equals to 4 and for x equals to minus 1, y equals to minus 4 where the possible values of x and y is our answer. I hope you have understood the solution. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon for more such interesting videos. Thank you.